I wanted to join a group of just people who were getting together to do something fun, but then I also wanted something really physical and active just to keep fit, to keep active, keep healthy, and so I'm definitely getting that. <laughs> Roller derby is more than just staying active. It's a grueling sport with nonstop contact and nonstop action. For newcomers to the sport, like Elizabeth Wells, it can be an eye-opener, and the vets let them know by labeling them as fresh meat. Fresh meat can be really intimidating because the, the physical requirements are definitely, are definitely a big factor in it. Well, it's not an easy process, but it's a very rewarding process. It's a lot of physical activity. Uh, obviously, it's a sport for kind of any body type. So you get a wide range of athletic people to people who are more interested in being blockers and, and just hitting people very hard. It's, it's good. It's, uh, you develop skills very quickly in the sport. It is, you know, it is a full contact sport. So here the newbies target them. They're the ones who are going to fall over if you hit them. It takes time to get coordination, balance and speed. But once those factors come together, well, look out. She struggles with uh, staying on her feet. <laughs> balance is a big part of it. And when she gets all of us, when we get tired, we get a little bit topsy. So that's a, that's a thing that we're working on really hard with her right now. But um, she's always here. She's super committed. I just got, you have to be, um, uh, you, like, you have to get your benchmarking for both. And I just got that uh, last week. She has the spirit of a lion. It's incredible. Like, you can knock her around and she'll fall down and she still gets up and still has a huge smile on her face. And it's, it's really awesome. From the early beginnings to the actual boats, the learning process may be steep, but it's worth it in the end. For Go, I'm Doug Roxburgh.